how did you start this company? Like, what was the idea behind this company that you started? Yeah, I mean, and you had, you never had your own company at that point. No. So you know, how did, yeah, what was the what was the mindset going into being an entrepreneur, basically? Yeah, I, I mean, I think I always looked at myself as my own company. You know, I, I'm one of those guys that is like. I'm always rep- repping me, right? I'm always yep. a sales guy. No matter what, even as a project manager, I was a sales dude. Yep. And I, I kind of looked at my day-to-day work and climbing the ladder and doing all that kind of stuff as my own personal business, right? Yep. So I had that mindset. Um, Matt had been involved in kind of buying into a company. And we had both watched, he worked for my uncle as well, we had both watched his journey. Yep. Um, and so we kind of had a blueprint out there of what it could look like. Um, but we wanted to put our own spin on it, right? We yep. we wanted to hire people that we we really liked, hire the people that we had been in the trenches with for for a lot of years yep. and had bled with and yep. spent yep. late nights with. You, and all you trust things. those people, yeah. yeah. And and then we sort of had a goal of not um, not going for these massive deals, but but kind of play in the in the medium sized spaces and knock those out of the park. And yep. uh, you know, we we did something kind of cool. The um, Matt and I were kind of the main uh, founders and shareholders, and we had a partner named Donnie who was a, a super smart tech guy. And then our first um, project manager, Deb, we all got together and we made a, me- a meal together out in Connecticut. Mm-hmm. And we all went and got our own ingredients, and we cooked together and kind of figured it all out and talked about the goals and the dreams. And the thing that came out of that was wild. It was like, you know, let's just do good work for good people. Let's not, let's not work for any clients that are assholes. Yeah. 